If you struggle with upper body rotation in the backswing, which equates to a little bit more arm depth, this is a great drill that you can implement within your practice in the backswing and also the downswing. So place the club against your shoulders, the grip end of the club is a reference point to your left shoulder, the club head is a reference point to your right shoulder. As you've got the club into the backswing, you want to feel like the club head disappears in the backswing, so our right shoulder's working up and back, so left shoulder's working down the cross, right shoulder's working back, as you can see from there, my right shoulder is working up the back, the club head disappears, my left shoulder is going to work down and across. As you can see from there, my left shoulder is lower than my right shoulder. Then as we come into impact, what's going to happen from there, my right shoulder is going to work down towards the golf ball, my left shoulder is going to work up and back. So as we come into the downswing, the club head is going to get lower to the ground and the grip end of the club is going to work up and back through impact. And the club to point almost in the instep of your right leg. Right shoulder is going to work up and back, club head is going to disappear behind your body. Then as we come back into impact, it's going to be a slight shift. My lower body is going to work lastly towards the target. As we come back into impact, the right shoulder is going to work down. As I start to shift to the left in the downswing, my right shoulder is going to work down so to my right hip and that's going to enable my left shoulder to work up and back through impact. So that rotation of the left shoulder working up and back for impact. The downswing is going to clear a pathway for my arms to work a little bit more from my body. It's going to enable me to transfer my weight into my left side and it's going to enable me to create a little bit more consistency to work up and back. It's going to encourage my chest to face the target. It's also going to encourage my rib cage to rotate into the downswing. My lower body as in my pelvis and it's going to enable me to transfer my weight onto my left side. If you struggle with body rotation in the backswing, just let the right shoulder work up and back and the back swing club head is going to disappear. Get a pen the club's going to point in the instep of your right leg. Then as we come into impact, the shoulder's going to work down. In the down swing, there's going to be a slight lateral shift in my lower body. Then my right shoulder's going to work down into impact. As you can see from there, if I rehearse my impact position, right shoulder's getting closer to my right hip. The left shoulder's going to work through impact. So right shoulder working down, left shoulder working up. And the left shoulder working up and back is going to encourage the rib cage to start opening up towards the target. It's going to enable me to transfer my weight onto my left side and it's going to allow everything to face the target, my rib cage and also my pelvis. So if you struggle with a the backswing, there's a great drill that you can implement within your practice. It's going to help you achieve a little bit more success.